Hello friends, welcome to CSAP space. Today in this video session, we will discuss about how to pass a JWT bearer token in the header of Swagger. So let's start. We open our Visual Studio and here I already create a project for uh, uh, SP.NET Core Web API with uh, uh, JWT authentications. So here this contain uh, all the push methods and uh, uh, create uh, and one demo API for testing that uh, authentications. So I already explained this project in my previous video session. You can check it out here. I provide a link for this video in description of um, this video. So you can check from there. So let's start. So I need to add a functionality for passing the tokens. So need to change it here. Like I'm adding uh, Lambda expressions. And then here c dot swagger doc and then here we provide like version one and then new uh, open API info and then we provide like here a title title like I'm writing here uh, JWT token auth api and then version now uh, we provide c dot add security definitions and then here writing uh, beer definitions new open api security scheme and then here we provide a like a name name is like this authorization and then we provide a type type is equal to security scheme type dot uh, api key and then scheme is equal to scheme is bearer and then uh, bearer format bearer format is uh, jwt and uh, then in input is, uh, is parameter header the parameter parameter location dot header and then description uh, you can provide it any descriptions yes like uh, here uh, inter uh, jwt token with beer format uh, like beer space like uh, I'm writing it here beer space then your token now we add a security requirement add security requirements and then here it's a uh, new open security requirements then here we add a new open api sec security scheme then here provide reference is equal to new new open api reference and you provide a type is equal to reference type dot security scheme and then you provide id id is uh, bearer and then 
uh, provide a new string this showing some error message i think there is some uh, brackets problem so this uh, here so need to add it here one more bracket for adding this into dictionary so i add it here now error is uh, removed now this uh, changes has been done so error is now removed so now uh, i run this application and enter this username and password for generating a token so i am pressing ctrl f5 to run this application by default this uh, swagger is created so first of all without passing the token we call this uh, demo api so this will uh, not showing the expected result so this re showing a response status uh, 401 because uh, there is a required authentication here so for creating this first of all uh, need to create a token for this so i'm adding a username it's like a user and then password is user123 and then click on execute this created a uh, bearer tokens so copy it here and then we pass this uh, token to here this uh, new button for authorization uh, this is the headers name and in that is provided in the uh, swagger configurations so i am writing here it's a bearer then uh, paste that token then click on authorize and here this is uh, successfully login now close it now again we call this uh, demo api for getting expected result so now this expected result is uh, displayed this uh, hello world that we here we created here we created so uh, this is the complete process for how we can pass the token uh, inside the JS, uh, inside the swagger so if you have any problem any questions please write in comment box i will reply soon so if you like my videos please don't forget to click on subscribe button and also click on notification bell so thanks thanks for watching we will meet in next video session